Hey everybody, welcome back. I hope everybody's doing well. Today we're going to be talking about some fun stuff. We're going to be looking at simple probability and odds. A probability is the likelihood of an event occurring. Simple events are the events where one experiment happens at a time and it will be having a single outcome. And the probability of simple events is denoted by P of E, where E is the event. So we can define P of E as the number of favorable outcomes divided by the total number of possible outcomes. So for example, if I have a coin and a coin has heads and tails, and for example, if I want to find the probability that I'll get a heads, so P of H is going to be, well, there's only one head, but there's two possible outcomes, right? Heads or tails. So the probability would be one half or 0 0.5. Probability is always a number between 0 and 1, inclusive. So if we look here, the probability that we have an event equal to zero means that this is an event that's impossible to occur. If I say the probability is one half, it means that it's equally likely to occur. Just as if I have a heads or tails, it's equally likely that if I throw it up and it lands, that I'll get a heads or a tails. It's equally likely. And a probability of one means that it will most certainly occur. Suppose I was asked to find the likelihood that a if I had a die and I rolled a die and I said, what's the likelihood of a two coming out? Well, on a die, I have six sides, right? I have one, two, three, four, five, and six. So if I said, what is the likelihood of a two occurring? Well, there's only one two. So the probability of two occurring is there's one two, but there's six sides, so one over six. Or 0.16, or approximately 16.7%. Similarly, I can say that the probability of one occurring is the same as the probability of two occurring, or three, similarly four, five, and six and they're all equal to 16.7% or 0.16. And if I were to add all these probabilities up, up to P6, I would get one or 100%. So what if we asked, what's the probability of rolling a die and getting an odd number? probability of odd. Well, if we look at it, we have one's an odd number, three is an odd number, and five is an odd number. So there's three possible outcomes all over the total number of outcomes, which is six or one half. Similarly, P of even, if we look at the even numbers, there's one, two, and three. So we're going to get 3 all over the total number, which is 6, which is also a half. So the probability of rolling an odd number on a die is 0.5. And the probability of rolling an even number on a die is also 0.5. And if we add the probability of odd plus the probability of even, 
we get the total sample space or 100% of the outcomes which is just one or 100%. This is a simple introduction of probability and probability one. Next, we'll cover more interesting topics on probabilities and give more examples. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Please click like, subscribe, and see you next time. Please stay safe.